Welcome back, guys, for the last episode. No! Yes, it's, it's the last episode in this series. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? I can't. I can't well, I can't believe that we're on, what, episode 29 or something? Wow. It's, been, it's, cra it's been a crazy, crazy journey. Um, I will say, the Lowlands is starting to look amazing. Just look at this. I'm, I'm seriously tempted to put a little bit of farming in over there. I've got so much to tell you. Um, there's been a lot going on. Uh, I've got so much. But you know what? In this episode, I, every episode has been so frantic. I've had so much to do. And so, and I've still got a lot to do in this episode. But I don't care. I don't care. To borrow from Picture Perfect vernacular, stress can <laughs> right off. <laughs> We're going to chill in this episode and just have fun. Because, boy, we've created a world again. It's, I, I freaking love this. Way. And I keep seeing things and thinking, oh, no, I, I should do this, and I should do this, and I should do this. Um, I, okay, let's start off with a couple of things I've got to tell you. So um, I wasn't necessarily expecting to be able to uh, make videos for a while because I got summoned for jury service. Oh, yeah. So I had to go to um, I had to go to my local court this morning, and uh, and and be a juror. But um, cut a long story short, they told me to bugger off. <laughs> um, it, it actually had something to do with me having a freaking panic attack when I got there, which really didn't help the situation. But hey, it is what it is, and the good news is that I'm back and I can do this sort of stuff. Hooray! And there was much rejoicing. I, I seriously, I, I'm going to turn it around because. I just love looking at this place. It's, it's good from every angle. You know what? Shall I start off with a little bit of... Um, I, I'm going to give you a little bit of look because you might be looking at this and saying, what the hell are these? These great big storages. Uh, do you not know? Good Lord. This, um, this is what makes the Lowlands famous. This, these, are the, um, these are the famous drying sheds. The giant drying sheds for the spadder dock. And the uh, and the cattail, and uh, you may see all of these showers around the edge and think, well, that's that's a lot of showers for the beavers. They, they don't need all of those showers. No, it's it's not for them taking a shower. Good lord, no, 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 no. Um, it's for rinsing the <laughs> um, particularly the spa not so much the cattail, but particularly the spadder dock. Uh, it needs uh, it needs a good rinsing before it's put away in the in the drying sheds. It's um, it's such a thing that it's become a bit of a saying. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's become a bit of a saying. Um, it means to um, to be well prepared because mm -hmm. you need to you need to prepare your spider dog. So, for example, like a, a guy taking a girl out. Yeah. Right. Um, his friends might say to him, I "Hope you've rinsed your spider dog." <laughs> <laughs> well, that's just what they say. Of course, they say it with a, with a, a southwest accent. Hope oh, you've rinsed your spider dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. it's going to be the whole episode's going to be like that, guys. Like if you were, if you were coming expecting something fast paced and loads of <laughs> now nah, forget it, forget it. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, the other thing, the other thing I need to tell you is um, so I'll, I'll switch. I'll put the hood on because um, we are now on cycle one forty five, day nineteen, and um, yeah, I accidentally left the game running overnight which um i it was a pure accident i hadn't planned on doing it um i wouldn't have intended to do it because i didn't think that, that like that we would survive but it ran about 12 cycles overnight uh completely unattended and it's freaking fine there's absolutely nothing wrong at all i've gone around to all the areas and checked them and they're all fine they're all absolutely fine Right, so what are we going to do in this episode, guys? We're just going to listen to you yak on. No, 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 I am going to do that. There's, there's, there is stuff to be done. Down here in the lowlands, should we start down here? Yeah, let's start down because there's stuff to do down here. There's a load of stuff to do for the for the pumping beavers. Um, there's a couple of things to look at in the highlands. So, yeah, and we've got to turn this into a district and um, that'll leave the, the pumping beavers as a separate district as well. And we've got to balance all of that out and make sure everything's everything's working properly before we can say goodbye. Uh, so, yeah, so down here, I've been working on... I, I 
I've started to really, really like this. We've got a little marketplace going on again. And I've got to say, I think this is a nicer marketplace than the one that I did in in the in the Highlands. So, so yeah, screw the Highlands, frankly. I'm, I'm a Lowlands man now. Go away now. Uh, so, so, yeah, we've got all of the different foods available in the market. You've got, uh, you've got your, what's this, carrots, and your grilled potatoes, and your grilled chestnuts, and that's a shrub. <laughs> that's um, sunflower seeds, and we've got bread and maple pastries, and we've got grilled spatterdock. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Grilled spatterdock. Available over here. Now, the way they make it in the lowlands, um, you know, it's a bit like real ales. I mean, grilled spatterdock, it's a bit of a bit of a delicacy. And uh, there are all kinds of different varieties that you can be like, if you go in the shop, it's not, you don't just go in and say, can I have some grilled spatterdock, please? They'd be like, well, which one do you want? Because they do all kinds. I particularly like the spicy varieties, like um, tactical nuclear spatterdock, <laughs> old sizzler. <laughs> You'll regret this. That's one of my favorites. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, have, I'll, have a, I'll have a couple of uh, a couple of packs of you'll regret this please <laughs> oh you'll regret that yes it's um yeah you'll be spending the day no, no. <laughs> let's not go there right um so yeah we, we've got the um we've got all the spatter dock sorted out we've got we've got a couple of spatter dock grills over here producing the old grilled spatter dock and if we go and have a look around the place which we're going to I'm thinking this is going to be a very free-form episode. I'm not, I'm not going to go heavy on the editing on this episode. Um, it's partially because I haven't got the bloody time because <laughs> I've spent literally half the day at the, at the court, at the courthouse. Um, what am I looking for? I'm looking for... What, I've forgotten. What the hell am I... This is why I edit. Oh, yeah, I remember. I was going to show you that we've got grilled spatter dock everywhere, but I've forgotten. Now I've forgotten. Where did I... Oh, it's in the town, you idiot. That's the blooming industry. Ah, yeah, yeah. If we come over here, this... Um, now, we've, we've got all the carrots and the grilled potatoes and the sunflower seeds in, in these buildings here and here. But if you come down by the by the big statue, then you've got your, uh, you've got your highland shop and your lowland shop. And we've got the, uh, the, what's this? This is the bread and the maple pastries. And here we've got grilled spatter dock in stock, available for purchase immediately. Awesome. If we go up to the Highlands, um, that's also the case. We go up to Highlands. Where's the Highlands market? The Highlands market is here. It's easy to find. And we should find, um, have I put the, did I put the grilled spatter dock in? Oh yeah, yeah. Because I did this little, I did, I did, did this originally. That, that's for the cattail. We haven't got the, the cattail crackers yet. We'll be doing that. Um, here's the grilled spatter dock. Awesome. So we've got the grilled spatter dock everywhere. We need to get the, um, we need to get the cattail going. So, how are we going to do that now? I, do you, if you remember, when when I started the lowlands and we started planting up the cattail, I was like, yeah, are we going to create the the the, the, the crackers, the cattail crackers, ourselves? Uh, here in the lowlands or are we going to ship out the cattail and have it uh, processed into flour and into cattail crackers somewhere else and I was um, I was concerned that I wanted to keep the thank you to the person that reminded me of the word agrarian I wanted to keep the um, the the rural primitive agrarian feel of the lowlands which look at look at this picture I'm, I'm going to go back and take the hood off again because I just I can't get over how freaking nice this looks it's very pretty. Doesn't that look great? Like just a few stands of trees around the place. And all of the the cattail and the spatter, especially when it's in bloom, when it's in full flower. It's awesome. Anyway, I wanted to keep that feel. And a few people were saying like, ah, oh, well, you know, you could, you could just like take some power from here, right? Which we absolutely do and then just have to have to like do it no 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 because that's no i don't want power lines and stuff going on so and then it suddenly occurred to me <laughs> use blooming power wheels which i haven't used anywhere else and i think it's a brilliant idea frankly you know not, not blowing my own trumpet <laughs> but at least letting you know that i've got a trumpet uh what do i want to do i want to put in uh food i want to put in a grist mill now i want to put in a couple of these 
Now this, I've been looking around trying to spot like where the hell could I do this? And it's actually difficult. There aren't too many spots. Um, it's because before this episode, I didn't properly rinse my spadadoc. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll put the we'll put the grist mill in there, and then it needs power. Now, how much power does it need? It needs um, 60 horsepower. Well, we can power that almost fully. It won't be fully powered, but we can almost fully power it by sticking in a power wheel. So let's grab a power wheel, flip it around. Yeah, and just bang it in there. And problem solved. We can create our uh, our cattail flower now. Awesome. Uh, and there's certainly no shortage of it around here. This is all the cattail. Uh, now, we need somewhere to sco store the, the cattail flower. Uh, but that's a separate problem. Let's come around here. I think what I'm going to do... Am I going to... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to get rid of this. Boom. That'll give me enough room to do the, well, the, well, a similar thing over here. I'm going to do it slightly differently, I think, to how, because I was originally thinking of putting the grist mill there and the power, but I'm going to do it slightly different, I think. It's not wildly different. It's not like you're going to go, wow, I never thought you'd do that. <laughs> um, I'm just going to do, I'm going to put it there. I was going to put it there. No, I was going to put it there. No, I'm going to put it there. Yes. Put it there, Sky. And then we'll, we'll throw in, what am I throwing in? I'm throwing in a path there, and then we want the power wheel, and the power wheel's gonna go in, flipped around, there. Awesome source. Okay, that gives us our cattail flower. We're gonna have to store that somewhere. Um, oh, that path needs to be extended, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Extend the path. There we go. Right, now, now we can get to everything. Um, so now what we need are a couple of bakeries. Now, I was thinking, maybe, I think they, I th I'm pretty sure they'll fit here. I, I haven't checked, but I'm, they're two by six, aren't they, the bakeries? Yeah! Okay. So let's assume for a second that I put the bakeries there, which I think is kind of a nice idea, because that's kind of the highest, it gives them a bit of pride of place. Yeah, I like that idea. And it's close to those. What we need is a bit of storage going on. It's been very fun uh, trying to figure out places to put things in in this little town. We need to come up with a name for this town. Picture, think of a name for this town. Just like that. No. Off the top of your head, just do it. No. Just, just come up with a fantastic <laughs> name instantly. And I need something to put here and I, I really don't know what to put here. I tell you what, it's a shame that the carousel is so freaking big. Because we could even do the carousel with a power wheel. But, like, where the hell would I put it? Okay, I've just had an idea. This this may be a very stupid idea. We'll see. Uh, oh, one of our grist mills has got built. Uh, let's set you up for cattail flour. Awesome. Uh, so, what was, what was this idea then, Sky? Well, look. We've got power over here. Um, I could even... I could even do, like, well, no, I don't want windmills down here. No, I don't want windmills in the, I, no, I'm gonna do, if I run a power line along here, I could run a sneaky little power, and, and I was, what what kind of triggered this was, I saw this fence and I was like, well, what, what the hell would that fence be for? But, if I put a power line going down here and I could have a fence on the other side, and we could have, just, just bring it across the river there, right? So, um, we'd have to have a little bridge, wouldn't we? Yeah. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> so, the bridge would go across there, and then power, and we'd have, we'd have a power line coming across here. Now, what I was thinking is maybe there's some guy who runs a little carousel, a little fairground kind of thing going on over here. Does that sound like, does that, does that sound, sound cool? Does that sound like I can't talk? <laughs> <laughs> kind of does, guy. Well done. Um, yeah, so where's the carousel? Let's see. This th this thing is freaking huge, though. Can I make this work? If, if I brought the power across like that. See, I, I, originally I was thinking that the, that the carousel would go kind of like that. And I still think that maybe that's the best idea. You know what? Let me build it. And let me see what I can do. Into I have no idea what else I could put around it. Um, 
And I'm thinking, like, do I try and disguise it in some way or something? Maybe, maybe put some trees around it. Uh, you know what? Let me have a little play around with this idea and I'll see what I can come up with. Well, this is what I've come up with. This is Fancy Dan's Carnival of Fun. <laughs> fun for all the Beaver family. <laughs> and the idea is it's just like fun and whimsical and yeah, whimsical. <laughs> we'll just go with whimsical, shall we? This is Fancy Dan's house. Now, what I'm thinking is that Fancy Dan's house needs to be um, kind of disguised a little bit. So I'm thinking, so I kind of need, like, I'd like to put trees in front of it or something. But then how do I control the trees so that they don't spread? Actually, this guy doesn't matter because like, they won't have a chance to spread because this is the final episode. <laughs> well, that is a point, but it's not a good enough point. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put some fencing in front of this. Uh, and then have the fencing going out here. So, um, I guess we'll just grab um, a, a temporary forester, throw him in, throw him in there, and then I'll plant up some some trees over here. What am I going to do? I, I guess I'm tempted to do the same kind of thing that I've done here and just have a little bit of a mix of trees. Because I think it looks quite good. What do you think, Picture? Yeah, yeah I like the mix. The mix of trees is quite yeah. good. While that's getting built, let's have a quick trip up to the highlands. Oh, it's coming to night time. This is, this is quite pretty at night. Look at all this. Look at all the lights. We've got the, we've got the temple. We've got the, 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 um, what are they called? The campfires. The campfires going on. We've got the, we've got the, the district center lit up. It's all very, very cool. Um, I put in a carousel. I've, I've adopted a, a couple of ideas that people have um, given me. I did. You know what? I read in the comments. Somebody was like, um, how come the Highland Beavers didn't get a carousel? And I was like, I put one in, didn't I? And actually, I was I was putting the carousel in over here, and then I changed my mind and I did all the all the bakeries and everything. Oh, that's a, that's the other thing. I I managed to squeeze in round the back. <laughs> I managed to just slip it in round the back. I squeezed in a fourth bakery. Oh yeah. So we've now got that's producing bread. That's maple pastries. That's bread. That's maple pastries. So um, yes, we've got. We've got two bakeries for each type of, um, of baked good. Okay, so that's um, so that's them. Oh, the mine. The mine. I want to do... I said I had an idea for the mine, and I want to do something. This is... I think this, is, this idea is inspired by the original Planet of the Apes film. Have you ever seen the original Planet of the Apes film no, picture? No, I haven't. You haven't? You've seen the new ones, but I you have, haven't seen the yeah. old one. Well, you've missed out. <laughs> She really is a heathen when it comes to, like, the classics, isn't she, guys? You should give us some stick in the comments. No. Yes, definitely. What's I do? Metal. We want to throw the mine in, right? Now, if you remember in Planet of the Apes, there was, like, an archaeological dig. The, the area had, like, bit, like scaffolding and stuff around it. And I thought we could try and dress this area up a little bit and make it look nice. So, that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm just going to grab... You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna grab some some of the some of the tall ones first and have have like I do want this to kind to be like a bit bit sort of randomish and then um, and then I'm just gonna kind of like throw stuff in around those and kind of like like build it up a bit kind of sorta of. that's that's the idea this may this may end up looking like something that something that a a monkey did. And when, and when I say that, I don't mean, like, something that a monkey designed. I mean something that a monkey did after eating some bad fruit. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's where this may end up going. How the hell do we get up to these? You know what? Let me, um, let me work on this a bit and see if I can make it not completely, totally rubbish. Uh, we've got to get the mine hooked up, so... Let, give me a path. Um, we'll get a path put in. And obviously the path needs to go over there. And prob... You know what? I, I guess the path should go around the mine. That would kind of make some degree of sense at least. Um, and then I want to put in some, some storages for some scrap metal and stuff like that. Let's, uh, again, let's let that get built. And yeah, we'll see if I can make this look like something. That leaves me with kind of one thing to do, which is, let me slow it down for a bit, um, which leaves me with the pumping beavers area. Uh, this needs to be tidied up like a fair bit, I think. 
what I, I mean with this storage i mean i was going to like re just re completely redevelop this and, and do some big storage complex but i'm not going to do that i'm not going to do that what am i going to do i think i mean this is just what we've got some dynamite and some some paper and stuff i mean this is remnants of the past and i don't think we necessarily want to get rid of that do we so maybe we just tidy things up and make it look a bit nicer now I could, I could just slap roofs on these things. Now you know what, let's slap a couple of roofs on and see what it looks like. So now we could do, um, we can do just like regular roof. I can mix it up a bit and put some tall roofs on. Um, let's see, where are we? We're, we're here. Like for these, maybe, maybe just, just slap a couple of roofs on and don't worry about it too much. Uh, maybe then we want something a bit different, so we'll throw on. Now, hey, if I had the roof, oh, I might do that over there. Yeah, yeah I'll save that idea. Um, we can throw in some tall ones, and bang, uh, bang the roofs on the top. Boom, boom, like that. That'll be a big, big improvement. Then, now, what can we, what, what can we do here that might be a little bit on the cool side? Um, for, the, for these two, we can use that idea that I just had, which was to turn it around, wasn't it? Um, so I want these flipped around and do that. But I've got to get to the middle roof, so we'll get rid of that one for now. We can build from that side, we can do that. Yeah, and then I'll put the third one in. What we, so what do we do with these then? Because we've got that little bit in the middle. Um, what, what I'm actually thinking is maybe, maybe with this one, we, we, we make this a little bit bigger. Yeah, let's do something. Let's be a little bit creative at least, guy. Come on, give it like, like show some kind of effort. All right, I will. Um, let's throw in a couple of medium storages behind. This, this might, this might end up looking rubbish, but we'll see. What was I, what was I going to do? I was going to get a couple of these. These a couple of these tall roofs. Hey, you know what? Do, do I? Maybe I have a tall. No, let's do something really asymmetrical. Yeah, yeah, let's try. So if we just have like that there and that. No, no, uh, uh, no, I've got it. Get rid of that. Um, I want a couple of platforms. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, the creative juices are uh, flowing. Yeah, Sky, that's more information than we needed. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. What am I doing? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to do this as quickly as I can because time is running out. What am I doing? Roof goes there. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Now. Um, oh, yeah. See, this is how things come together. If I put a couple of platforms in there, right, and then get a little square roof. Where is it? It's in decoration sky. Oh, thank you for telling me. And plonk that on there. Then we get a fairly unique looking building, don't we? Looks rubbish sky. Yeah, all right, thanks for that. Um, how the hell am I gonna get that built? I have no idea how I'm gonna get that built. Probably, if I don't do that, I can put some stairs going up, yeah. That'll work. I think. So I need to do paths and more roofs and all that kind of stuff. Stairs and things. Uh, okay, so that's an example of kind of what I'm going to do here. Uh, oh yeah, I'm doing the extra one on there. I've got to put the roofs on. Bonehead. Actually try putting the roofs on. This is going to be a lot of building work going on all over the place. I've got to do these. I've got to decide what I'm going to do with these. I think what I'm going to do with these is turn them around. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna demolish those and rebuild them there. I might put another couple in there just to kind of match it up. Um, God knows what I'm gonna do with the roofs on those. Oh, I think, I'll, yeah, no, I do. I think I do know what I'm gonna do with the roofs on those. Um, yeah, so a couple of warehouses there, a couple of warehouses there. Pff, I don't know what I'm gonna do here. Now over here, this, I promised I would do this and I'm gonna do it. Um, I'm gonna put some, some like blueberries and dandelions kind of like along here and along here. And then I've got to do the um, Lemonhead Memorial Park, haven't I? Yes, I have. 
you haven't got enough time, Sky, to do something elaborate here. Well, I'm going to just have to find the time, aren't I? Before I can get rid of those, I want to fill this in. That's a good point. Uh, those are going to have to go. Uh, and I'm going to have to hope that I've got enough. Oh, these are full, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, that should be fine. So, <laughs> there's just, there's so, it's, you get to the end of a series and you think, ah, there's not that much to do. And there's always so much to do. So I'm going to have to fill this in. Uh, we've got the catalyst here so that the uh, the bots who come and visit can get a nice uh, a nice cool drink of catalyst. Uh, we probably need some other stuff for people. I'm hmm, is there any power around? Yeah, there is power here. Oh, maybe there's a oh. Th this could be the solution. This could be the solution. Cuz I've always been, you know, I've always been unhappy with the carousel being up there. Maybe we rip the carousel out, maybe even the hot tubs as well, and we have them over here in the park. Oh, shall I do that? What do you think, Peter? Shall I do that? Yeah. Oh, so you've said yes now. I want to <laughs> no, I'm, I'm going to do it anyway. Even, even though it's obviously going to be a bad idea, I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, man. Let me do all of this. I'm going to run the game on a little bit. And we'll see what we end up with with our final look at this. I mean, I think it's incredible. This incredible beaver land. Okay, guys, we've got to talk. We've got to talk. Picture. Yeah. Uh, so I've, ju I've just been I've just been building this, which um, I mean, this was supposed to be just um, two warehouses with a, with a roof. <laughs> that was what it was going to be. And it's evolved. It's evolved into this, um, and it made me. Th it made me think of the books. I haven't done the printing presses to print the books and stuff yet, so that's got to be done. Uh, and then I, I was looking at this, and you know what? I was like, this. This needs to be duplicated here, because I, I, I started. Because I, I I put this in, and I had this kind of walkway idea, and then I was like, well. So we have a walkway going through here, and then and then I'm like, no, this needs to be here as well. And then I need to do the printing, and maybe the printing presses are behind here and stuff. And then I need to move this, and I haven't really got a metal story. And it just leads me onto a million things. Just, like, just come down here, right? So um, I, I've done a bit of stuff on here. I, well, if you're going to see it, you're gonna... so I started putting in a few things down here. I did this, right? I created this, 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 <laughs> this is an aquatic farmhouse. I put this in just to plant up the, the cattail down in this area, right? It was going to get demolished. And I came to demolish it, and I was like, oh, I said I was going to put some houses in down here. Well, maybe maybe I keep this and we have a little isolated hermit fisherman who's got a little house with a little garden and whatever. And then, yeah. So I, I, I planted that up, and, and I, I was like, no, I want to do more. And then if I look around the map, there are still areas that, like, I, I got them to fill a bit of this in. And then I was like, well, yeah, but it's still a, it looks a bit unfinished. And I've still got these piles running around and these paths look ugly. And, and like, what about this? You know, and stuff like that. Um, is the mine done? Yeah, let's go and have a look at how the mine's getting on. Oh, they've built, they've built, a, they've built a bit of it. Still a lot of it to build. I, I, have, oh, I still haven't finished putting this stuff in. There's too much. I can't finish it. <laughs> there needs to be. Doesn't there need to be another episode picture? It kind of seems like it. There needs to be another episode. It's. I'm having too. I'm having way, way too much fun. I'm going to turn the hood off for a second. It's like, it's too, it's too good to leave it unfinished. I think. So I tell you what I'm going to do. I mean, there is going to be another episode, but I'm going to leave it up to you guys in the comments. Um, what do you, I mean, what do you think? Don't you think that this deserves to be finished off properly? Because I think it does. I mean, if all of you go, you know what? No, just just walk away. We want to see update. <laughs> just it's garbage. You you you're wasting your time. What's the point? Um, get on to update five. Then um, <laughs> I'll probably ignore you and do it anyway. <laughs> frankly. But yeah, you know what? I'm going to speed it. I want to get. I want a, a, a last look in the daylight. There's so much to do. I haven't even touched Lemonhead Memorial Park. 
Uh, I couldn't I couldn't take these these guys out until I was finished with all the terraforming and and there is bits of terraforming that I still need to do. So yeah, guys. Um, oh, and look at this. It's not it's not there's still a few roofs and things to put on, but um, you can, um, oh, I've got to turn the hood back on so I can click on this. Yeah, we've got to get the roofs finished. But fancy Dan's house of fun. <laughs> has turned out blooming awesome look at that i think i think that's turned out brilliant i need to get them to finish this i need to prioritize those those need to be finished asap uh, finish that and finish that wow so i wanted to i it's the last finishing touches that to kind of complete it so i'm going to shut up i'm going to go away i'm going to wait to see what you guys say in the comments Say goodbye, Peter. Bye. See you guys. We'll catch you for the next one. Peace out.